Well, Tom, she tells us that she looked around at a family reunion this summer and realized she was missing too much time with family. Then she says her decision was made when she became a grandmother. Thank, Thank you very you. much. Sir. Thank you very much. Congresswoman Carol Shea Porter says don't call it retirement, but a pause. The first woman ever elected to federal office from New Hampshire has served four terms in Congress, representing the first district on and off since first elected in 2006. She tells News 9 after this term, she wants to spend more time with her growing family. You miss so many occasions as you go through, and it's, it's part of the price that you pay willingly to serve, but then I became a new grandmother for the first time, and that tugged also. But I decided it was a good time to pause and, and just take a little time and, and you know, be, be in place with family and with friends. She proved to be remarkably durable for someone who's not a professional politician. She's won, she won four out of six. That's a pretty good batting record. UNH political science professor Dante Scala says open seats are typically easier to pick up, giving Republicans hope and Democrats time to plan. Does give the Democrats the maximum amount of time to find a candidate who could succeed her. Representative Carol Shea Porter says she will work every day of her fourth term. Thank you to the people of New Hampshire, and I really plan to work very hard until the last day in office. And it's a great honor, and I've been grateful. And her term ends in January of 2019. Live in the studio, Jean Mackin, WMUR News 9.